My name is Haley Wright and welcome to another edition of Emerging Issuer. Joining us in the studio today is Derek Bartlett, the Chief Executive Officer of Newport Gold Inc., a company that trades on the over-the-counter bulletin board under the symbol NWPG. But before we start the interview, here's a little information on the company. Newport Gold Incorporated, an exploration stage company, engages in acquisition, exploration and development of mineral and energy properties. The company holds an option to acquire nine claims consisting of 47 units in the Burnt Basin property located 25 kilometers northeast of the city of Grand Forks in British Columbia, Canada, and an option to earn 20% of a 50% interest held in certain mineral exploration rights located in Inner Mongolia, China. The company was founded in 2003 and is based in Reno, Nevada. Derek, welcome to the broadcast. Thank you very much. Now let's start off. How and why did you acquire these properties? Uh, the first property the company acquired was the Burnt Basin property. It was acquired because a very high-grade gold mine had operated in the early 1900s. It averaged one ounce per ton, and it still is open in all directions. Very little work, if any, has ever been done in the last hundred years. We think this is an excellent uh, opportunity for Newport to uh, develop a high-grade gold mine. In addition, there was some base metal mining, lead zinc, with some high-grade silver and copper as well. There is a large area that is totally untested and probably the extension of the previous mining that was done in the 70s. China in Inner Mongolia, which is part of the People's Republic of China, we saw an opportunity for a turquoise hill type of deposit, which is a bulk mineable copper gold deposit. And uh, again, a pit was found with very high grade gold mineralization, and a very large area was mineralized, and it's open in every direction. We thought this was an excellent chance for Newport to develop a bulk tonnage copper and gold mine. Great, Derek. And now as far as the future of the exploration company, it seems that the interest is really in acquiring good properties for the future. Now is that your company's overall objective? Our overall objective from the beginning was to acquire properties that could be readily put into production and had uh, large uh, size potential. And we think we have done this uh, in terms of what we see, both uh, in terms of gold and base metals on the Burnt Basin property, and copper and uh, gold on the uh, Chinese deposit. Now, Derek, there's not have been a lot of news on the company in the past outside your normal filings that, you, that you're doing. Now, can you explain the opportunity in the Burnt Basin region in the uh, project in China? Both projects have options on them, and now where are your goals on that right now? Burnt Basin property, we're still waiting for assays that are six months overdue. And uh, we do expect to get a lot of very good values there. And uh, our program this summer will be drilling and following up on those uh, values that we have uh, uh, come up with over the last uh, two exploration periods. We do expect to start work in May. And uh, it would be mostly uh, diamond drilling on existing zones and existing targets. Uh, in China, we have completed a geophysical survey and we will be following up on that in the uh, summertime and again we do plan to do a first phase of drilling to test the extent of this very high grade copper and gold mineralization down dip and along strike. Great. Now Derek, the last question. Uh, this is primarily for our viewers out there. Why should the investment community stand up and take notice of Newport Gold? Well. Uh, we believe that we have an excellent chance of developing a base metal mine on the uh, Burnt Basin property and we do have, I think, an excellent chance of outlining additional high-grade gold mineralization on the old Molly Gibson zone as well. Uh, in China, likewise, uh, our geologist has already uh, suggested a drill program along with some uh, underground mine development, although it's very early days at this time. And uh, again, we are looking for a bulk tonnage uh, copper gold deposit, similar to what we see uh, 
about 200 kilometers to the north where Ivanhoe is outlined over 2 billion tons. There are a lot of similarities between our property and that property, and that's been verified by two independent geologists. Great, Derek. Now, for more information on Newport Gold, their business and management team, you can visit their website at www.newportgold.com. Well, that's it for me. For Emerging Issuer, I'm Haley Wright. Thanks for watching.